All right, I'm gonna make this little video real quick. Uh, working on my 85 Suburban and um, not real sure if everybody's familiar with trying to put speakers in the doors or anything like that. Sorry about the finger. But you run into a problem where in the Chevrolets, this is a solid piece of metal here. Um, and you can't, you know I mean, this is where the wire comes in. Now, if you take the door here, I'll show you. I'll give you a, give you a little, hold on, let me grab my flashlight. Sorry, working on it. All right, so this is the C10. So <clears throat> this is what you kind of, this is kind of what you got. I don't know if you can see it over there. There's no wires in this one because this is going to be a um, frame off build that we're going to be doing to sell. So I'm not going to hack this one up. That one's mine. But you figure you got to take all that out. You got to run it out of the door. You know, you take the door off if you really want to run it the right way. But if you're like me and you're going to drive it and you're probably never going to sell it, and who cares? I'll show you what I did. I took my air nibbler. I cut me a hole. I ran a, uh, this is a uh, two foot, two foot uh, zip tie through the door, into the door. And I'll just, you know, put my speaker wires in there. And then I cut the hole good enough to, because obviously if you're familiar, sorry about the camera. If you're familiar with the C10, the uh, plate, that's the seal plate here, is really flat there's no room for wire so the only wire is your old spot it's got a spot for it so you know cut it up pretty good size so if you can't I put it up up there pretty good so you can zip it to that and you can't really see it i mean i want it and even though it's mine i don't want to make it look too ugly so but yeah that's kind of what i did i don't know i didn't really see anybody that showed anything so i want to kind of show it so I cut a hole with my nibbler, and um, you kind of run into a problem here, the double plate. You might need to get your grinder. I actually cut this with my grinder first. I cut a square hole with my grinder uh, right below. I cut that right below the the uh, door pin switch because the wires, you know, you might cut the wires, but if you cut them, you know, at this point you got a hole, you can pretty much, you know, know where they go. So that's what I did. Just thought I'd share it with y'all.